Well, officials want to point out that this is extremely rare. Out of more than 6 million Johnson & Johnson vaccines that have been administered across the country, uh, so far there's been six reported cases of this rare but serious blood clot that at least in one case uh, turned fatal uh, and in another patient uh, resulted in a critical uh, hospital stay. Uh, but that's why right now Mecklenburg County officials say they agree with the FDA and CDC's pause on the J&J &J vaccine so that this can be studied. Uh, today at Bank of America Stadium, there was a vaccination event. I spoke with two people who were both getting the Pfizer shot and both had mixed opinions about stopping the shot. I think that's overly cautious. Uh, if the vaccine is 95% effective, like they say, then getting people vaccinated will probably benefit the public more than halting vaccination over six blood clots. It's better to be safe than sorry. The FDA says if you got the vaccine a month ago that your risk is very low. However, if you did get it in the last couple of weeks, it could be problematic. Uh, officials are warning that if you experience any of these symptoms, I'm going to read to you, they're severe headaches, abdominal pain, leg pain, uh, or shortness of breath, you're urged to seek medical treatment. We're live in Charlotte, Matt Grant, Fox 46.